Hi, in today's video, we're excited to demonstrate the Navix video interface for the 21 and newer Ford F-150 and the 22 and newer Ford Super Duty trucks that come with a 12 inch screen. Using this interface, we're able to add an HDMI input as well as an audio input that is direct so there's no sound lag. The unit also has the left, the right, and the front view camera input and they'll let you override the original camera for the people that replace their tailgates and put trailers in the back of their cars. So in this video, we're gonna demo the camera system, the left, the right, and the front camera. You will notice the 360 button that this car did come with 360, so it's just for demonstration purposes for the trucks that did not come with a 360 camera. So if you have the 360 camera and you just wanna add an HDMI input or just add a trailer input, you'll find it will not affect the way the 360 camera system works, it'll continue to work the same way. All right, so let's go ahead and demo the HDMI input first. You're gonna press and hold the button on the steering wheel, the back button, all right? Using the Apple AV adapter, we're gonna connect the iPhone. Very important, this unit will do video and audio since the car has no aux. This unit gives you a direct audio input with no lag. You will not experience any lag in the audio while playing your video content. All right, let's load another video. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead and show you the camera system. You press the left turn signal. You will see the left camera. Let's press the right turn signal. All right, and the way you engage the front camera is by putting the car in reverse and then shifting into drive. That'll engage the camera. And the camera, in this case, will stay on for 10 seconds. You can set it up anywhere from five to 25 seconds. You can change the time that you want it to stay on. You can also access the cameras by holding the same back button. So let's go through the camera modes by holding the back button on the steering wheel. All right, so let's say you don't want to use the turn signal. You just want to monitor. Let's say you're towing and you want to monitor. So you can just use the, the button on the steering wheel. The unit also has inputs. We have a lot of people requesting where they can just uh, put their own switches. You could do that. The unit does give you the ability where you can just put an aftermarket switch. They'll, they'll let you press the switch and any camera you choose will come up immediately. Um, so we pretty much added every conceivable feature that people usually ask for. All right, again, if you have the 360 camera system, your camera system will continue to work the same way. If you have a truck that just came with a rear camera and you're looking to add additional cameras, this unit will let you do that. All right, um, thank you for watching and please make sure to visit navix.com.